Hi everyone, this is Dave from Diecast Toys Plus here and I have my son Tommy with it, me here today. Say hi Tommy. Hi. Smile. Alright, we have here, these are my 124 scale diecast cars that I have. I have six of them here, they're, they're actually all General Motors. So Tommy, which is your favorite car here? The yes. Suburban? Yeah. Alright, we'll start with the Suburban then since that's Tommy's favorite. Uh, it's a 93 Suburban, it's a police truck. And uh, the hood doesn't open on this particular model, but the doors open on it. And it's kind of neat. The mirrors actually fold in on it. So they, you know, so when you're parked, you can kind of just fold the mirror in, then you can fold it back out. That's kind of a neat little feature. I haven't seen anything like that on any diecast before. And the back tailgate's supposed to open on it. Uh, it's kind of hard, it doesn't want to come open there. But it does open, the tailgate does open. And I just can't get it open. It has a third row, it has a third row seat in there. I don't know if you can see through the tinted glass, but there is a third row seat in there. Uh, the, ba the back doors don't open. You have to look close to see. Yeah, you have to look close. And then the bottom is just kind of a plain plastic bottom. It's nothing fancy. And it's got red lights in the front. It's got the square lights on the roof. So that's a that's a nice one. Yeah. Which one next time? Yes. You wanna do this one? Alright. Next one we got is a 69 GTO. This one, I think the hood does open on this one. Yes. And it has a motor inside there. You can see on the bottom too. Yeah, you can see on the bottom. If I'm not, it has GTO in the grills there. It says GTO. Yeah. It's got the... And on the side. It's got the GTO on the side of it. The door is open on here. You can see it's got a shifter in there. Chrome shifter, black steering wheel. This opens easy. Yeah, the rear trunk lid opens on this one too. It says GTO on the rear deck lid. It's got the spoiler. And then the other side. And then on the bottom, it's kind of just got a, a flat base on there. And the motor, the motor's like the top of the motor, it's a separate piece from the base. On that one. Alright. What else we got? The Nova? Alright, we're gonna do the Nova next. Alright, I got a 72 Nova. No, actually it's a 70 Nova SS. Has the SS badges on it. And the hood opens on this one too, and it has a motor in, in there. This one is actually a Maisto on this just Nova. The door is open on the Nova. This one's just got a full bench seat inside there. But it has the Nova, uh, I think it says 396 on the front fender. It's got cr the chrome around the doors or painted on there. Cool. Yeah, it's neat. And it says Nova SS on the back. And it's got a little crack in the mm -hmm. back glass up here. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah. It's got the wheat mags. Uh, let's see there. And it does say on the bottom, it does say Maisto on there. Alright, which one next? The yeah. Trans Am? Yeah. Alright. Next one's a 73 Trans Am. And it's got the bird, the pretty bird on there. And I think this hood will open on this one. Yeah, it does. There it goes. And there's the motor underneath there. Doors can open. Yeah, the doors open on this one. And on this. And it's got the front spoiler on there. Vroom, vroom. It says Trans Am on the fenders. And it's got just a black shifter in there. It doesn't have that nice chrome shifter like the GTO had. I'm driving with doors open. Yeah. One door open. And it says Trans Am across the back.
on the other side. And the bottom is like the GTO. It's just a plain base on the bottom. Just has the cast it in the cast it in the exhaust and the rear axle and the gas tank. Which one's next, Tommy? Alright, next we're gonna do the 65. It says 65 Chevelle SS on the bottom of the car. But it says Malibu on the rear quarters. And this one here is the only one that actually has a a full pull-out motor like on it. If you look inside there, that's actually a motor that's a whole motor that's put in there on this one. And the door is open on it. And it's got little stickers on there for the gauges on the dash. And the back says so Chevrolet across the back there. It's got chrome on the side down at the bottom. Door handle, the SS badges on the front fenders, and then underneath, I'll turn it this way. You can tell it's got a full motor in there with the transmission. It's not molded into the body. It's it's a separate piece, and the exhaust is separate, separate exhaust piece on there, and it does say 65 Chevelle SS on there. But it actually says Malibu on the quarter panels. So that's that one. And then the last one is the 65 Impala SS convertible. Whoa. Yeah, isn't that, that's nice how they did the interior there. How they kind of got a shifter. It's got a nice console in there. Could open it, I think. And it looks really nice inside inside the interior. The hood opens on this one. It's got a big block 409 under the hood. Chunk open. It has the 409 emblems on the front fenders. And then the trunk. And it only, it only has like one mirror. mirror it has one mirror. Two. These and the trunk hood opens on this one. It's just plain inside. And these do have one mirror too. Yeah, those have one mirror. This one actually the mirror is missing on it. That's what the problem is. I see a hole there on the door, so that mirror is missing. But it's even got the vent windows, right, vent glass right on the door. Mm -hmm. That's a nice little like these two. nice detail. Some visors are on top. And these two. two. And then the front. And then the bottom is just like the other, the Pontiacs, it's just a plain base, except they have the exhaust painted in silver on this one. Hmm? Silver? Yeah, see the exhaust? Oh. There's silver underneath there. Yeah. So this is our 124 scale cars that I have. Got a few. So. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Also, I'd love to hear from you in the comments below. And be sure to subscribe to my channel for further video upgrades. Until next time, drive safe.